Hi my lovelies, I'm partially vlogging right now, but I'm also, I just want to really talk about beginners in witchcraft, okay? Like, if you have those negative people that tell you, oh, you're not a witch, you weren't born a witch, oh, you just started to, no, if you're practicing the craft and you're learning, you are a witch. Whether you're a new witch or an old witch, everyone's welcome and everyone's, you know, like, speaking of that, I'm going to be, I'm going to have a Facebook, um, a Facebook group where all new witches can meet each other, you can talk about different things, post memes, post just regular posts, and it's going to be a private, so if you're afraid of your parents, like, witches coming out of the broom closet. But anyway, going forward, I wanted to talk to you guys about, for one, like I've said this before, not every witch does tarot cards. A lot of them do. A lot of them attracted to the tarot. I read tarot not because I'm a witch. I read tarot because it's something that I can do. I'm good at something I like. I've always been interested in the occult. I've always been interested in astrology. I've always been interested in that stuff. And there's different types of witches. You know, the whole thing of, oh, do, worship, do, do witches worship the devil? No, they don't worship, worship the devil. A lot of them, like Wiccans, there's so many different types, but Wiccans per se, they don't look at um, the devil as an actual deity. They don't, they don't look at him as someone that even exists, I guess, okay? Um, a lot of them do take some Christian views, but the Christian devil is not something that they, um, you know. Uh, and going, well, I want to also talk about, a lot of you guys are as asking the question, I'm sure, if you're at that point or you've already gotten past it, what deity should I choose? Okay, you don't necessarily have to have a deity, it's good to, but now if you're working a certain type of spell, like a love spell, um, a spell for money, abundance, things like that, self-love, whatever you're doing, I hope it's good, I hope it's nothing negative, but, you know, choose your own path. Make sure that, you know, you. it's always good to read, but you don't have to, but just don't follow everything, like you read this somewhere, then you read something different somewhere else, and then you see something different on YouTube, like, go with what you feel is right. It's always within you. Even your magic and your spells. If you're past the point where you've already done, you know, um, you've already kind of done a few spells, and I would recommend a protection spell always, and always cleanse your area. You can cleanse your area, if you don't know already, with sage and stuff like that. Um, or you can even get salt water and make like a salt water solution and just cleanse the hot home with that. There's a lot of things you can do. And if you happen to have any questions, please let me know. I'd really, really, that was my sister, I'm sorry. I'd really, 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 really appreciate it. And I would love to myself meet some witches, new or old. Um, you know, we can learn from each other. I learn from you, you learn from me. Every day we all learn something new and it's beautiful and it's great. And it's positive. Witchcraft is actually one of the most positive things. When I was, you know, a lot younger, this is a private thing, but I'm going to put it out there because I like to help addicts and things like that as well. I like to help people. I'm a healer. Um, when I was first, back in my day, I was an addict. And you know what happened? I got a lot better. Part of my my healing was witchcraft, and it was Wicca. And it does, the roots do run back... Uh, to my family. My sister said, I don't know if people like to talk about anything about witchcraft related that I do. Uh... She making a weird face right now. No, I, I'm not against that. So, okay, do you want to say something? What, what can I say? I don't know, say some, anything about what, how do you, do you feel that I am a witch? Or do, do, you, uh, do, you, do you agree with Grandma, Millie? Do you remember when Gram, Grandma, uh, Grandma, not Grandma, Millie, the uh, other Grandma that we never met, when she was a Franny? witch? Granny? Yeah. I mean, Grandma, Granny. I do... I have like a, like an inner, sorry about the camera, I, I can't explain it, like, like an inner feeling, right? A feeling like I'm connected to her in some way, Okay. even though I never got to actually meet, meet her, her physically. But you feel that connection. But I have a connection to her. I don't know how, um, but I do. And I have her picture in my, my kitchen, and I say good morning to her every morning, and I do feel very connected to her. I don't know why, I just It's do. because it's, she, I think she's trying to pull the inner witch out of you, Megan. Like, we were talking, <laughs> no, really. I don't know. Like, we were talking about today, like, we were talking about today that, you know, we're descended from a line of witches, and she asked me if it was love. And, well, yeah, you know, I mean, just a spell maybe to, like, um, or maybe even just some, like, help with, like, 
you know, conceiving a child. Like, yes, and those spells, those spells are possible. Yeah. Those spells are absolutely possible. And and you, so you do believe in spells and spells helping you. If, if the medicine medicine doesn't help and things like that, then you have to go. To yeah, spiritual. I never took any medicine. I, you know, wouldn't, I wouldn't or the take doctor, any medicine. Or the doctor, you know, <laughs> the, whatever the doctor said. But I'm saying, like, would you yourself consider, did you know, and well, let me also say, did you know that there were such a thing as Christian wishes and things like that? Yes. Okay. And would you yourself consider being a way, or trying it out? Like, do you think that maybe a finding well, a path, like... Oh, I believe in that, yes. But you think you'd ever practice it yourself? Like, you don't have to do herbs Well, I don't know. I mean, I don't know if I'm actually, like... Yeah. But that's how they all feel at first. Like, oh, I don't know if I'm good at it, but you you get good at it through learning, and that's what I'm trying to tell them. Like, you get you get better at it through learning. But I do feel that I have a connection. You feel energies. Those are all yes. the signs that you're a witch. Oh, I definitely. You just have to break that open. To break open the seal. A hundred percent. Even though I never actually got to meet her, have her in the flesh, I know. Yeah. That I have a connection to her. It's strange. I, I feel can't explain the connection, but I do have it. It's like yeah. It's like I feel the same way. Like I, I, I just feel totally connected to all of my family, especially that side. I know the witches. They were born out. What was that? The West and the oh, on no, the mountains. Oh no, they were the um. Well, I mean, they're they're the uh, Columbia, the the not Columbia, Kentucky Plateau. The, Kentucky Plateau. They're, they're um. They're like uh, I don't know what you would call it. Well, they were like not Midwestern. Not, they were Midwestern, like but Grandma was from Kentucky. They were the pine, well, like the first pioneers to come to America from England is uh, Scots Irish. And there was a big um, uh, in Scots Irish. They were the first ones. They to come. came down and they uh, they settled in uh, Pulaski County, Kentucky. And that's also where I I watched a video a documentary today. Our that. family has generations and generations of um, of uh, family and. Uh, in, in Pulaski County, Kentucky. Yeah, and like, and also my grandmother. I'll get into that later. But I was gonna say I watched a video where it was actually in Scotland, or not even in Scotland, but it was a Scottish. I don't know. I think it, I'd have to read a little bit more into that. But there was some type of like witch trials in Scotland. I think before they happened in Salem. Yeah, but I think the Salem part is different from our our family that. That's um, like grandma. Our family that Other um, grandma. they they went through they came in through I think like um, I think like in uh, Philadelphia or somewhere over there they came down and uh, worked their way down into um, the Appalachian Mountains and uh, through West Virginia and the Carolinas and then they finally settled in Kentucky and they finally settled in um, Samoset, Pulaski County, Fishing Creek, Kentucky. And that's where our family set up for a long yeah. and time. Gr and Grandma was, we know our grandmother was a witch. We were kids, remember? We, we have Oh, wife. that's separate, though. That Our family from our mother is separate from our family from our father. Oh, yeah. But they're both they're, they're Irish. But yep. the Irish from Dad's side is Ulster, Scotland. And, Ulster, and Ulster, Ulster Island, Ireland, a lot of witch which is Scots Kel Irish. Kel 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 and, our fa and our mother is... Um, well, Southern uh, Southern Island, which is a uh, uh, county court. That's different from yeah. what Dad had the Scots Irish part. Sorry, there was a long history on. It's just a lot. lot. Yeah, yeah <laughs> like, it's a long history on all my family. But but, but basically, we do we know what you know, said we from which is. Our family on my father's part, you know, a lot of they call them hillbillies or whatever. Yeah, they call them hillbillies. But they, you know, they have a lot of um, you know. Home remedies for stuff. Yeah, home, that's it. The home remedies. Yes. That's how you yes. know with your witch. If your family yes. has done this, if your um, grandparents did this, this is how you know you could very well you know, be descended from witches. You know, they they got a lot of home remedies and, and ways to treat things from home. And like when uh, not what, uh, spells, but you know they are spells though because well, yeah, you're, when, you, when you're putting your intent, that's what people don't understand. When you're putting your yeah, intent, dad would call an MD, a mountain doctor, a mountain doctor, and actually <laughs> mountain doctors is something that they were uh, witches were. That's another word that was called for witches back in the yeah. day. Look that up. You know. So basically, I just wanted to talk about my history, my family history on which. We got a little bit of a crazy family. Yeah, my family's dysfunctional as <laughs> fuck. But but seriously, just talking about the you know, and when you're first getting into it, do I like herbs? Think about the things you like. If you like it all and you like me, a I do. Yeah, then you know what? Learn it, 
and live, live it, believe it in your heart. The, the, the main things is belief, belief in yourself. It's all about you. You have to, you will get the belief. As you start, you may be like, I'm not doing this right, blah, blah, blah. But after a while, you get that belief in your heart. You learn more. You get better at it. And you, 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 it's like when you're meditating, you want to close your eyes and make something happen. You're moving energies around. Watch my, my video on the energy balls. I'm telling you, I learned this stuff as I got older, like partially, not only books, but you, through YouTube videos. There's someone who I follow who I absolutely love, and I don't know if she wants her name, so I'm not going to say it at this moment. But she's another YouTuber who's amazing. And because of her, I, I was able to break out of my shell more and start doing witchcraft again and found myself and actually found my path, found who I am. Am I an eclectic? Am I a Wiccan? Am I this? Am I that? I don't know, because a lot, I mean, a lot of those Scots are no Protestant. I know, but there was a lot of Celtic witches. They even yeah, had no, Celtic diamonds. I'm just like saying. A hedgeway. Lot of, I was called Hedway, a Hedgeway. I'm the, not exactly and a quiz. sure what our family not that I believe in was that came over really here. Like, I believe they were Protestant, but I'm not sure 100%. Oh. But, I don't know. That's like, that's like a whole thing on... Um, you know, your beginning path, my history of my family in witchcraft, I guess. I don't even know what to call it, but it's just basically a little bit of my background and getting into it. Getting into it, I'm telling you, like, I, I there was times when I felt like I wasn't, like, good enough and I wasn't doing something right, but as long as you start to feel more and more... Somewhere. Right, you, like my sister said, and I always say that you got to start somewhere. And it's Nobody true. Starts Nobody starts perfect. Even like with my YouTube videos, they're going to get so much better because I know they. And if you if you use positive affirmations, you're going to get positivity in your life. I've seen it. I've lived it. I've done it. You guys know I never say anything. I've never, I've never seen or accomplished myself. Okay. So take care. This is Boston Galtaro Raven here. Um, and if you have any questions, let me know. Like, what do you want to know? What, what would you like me to do a video on? Would you like me to do a spell on a video? Do you have a question? Please, please let me know. I'm sorry that everything's fast today, but I have family over and stuff, so I don't want it to be too nuts. <laughs> All right, take care, guys. Bye.